Okay, mini bash, 7th of March, 2021. And I do pray you're all well, and I know that you're not all well. I know that there are many that are struggling and scared. They don't know what to do. Even those in Christ have fears, which is a natural thing. That's why it's more important than ever to strengthen your faith. Understand, when it boils down to it, it's spiritual from its very core. We're just witnessing it manifest in our natural world. So, strengthening your faith and belief in what Jesus Christ has done is key to getting through this. I know I always say this. I got so much to share with you guys, but it's true. The whole Pope thing, I mean... It's pretty amazing, going all the way back to Trump and his Trump Tower in Atlantic City. Generation Z, Israel. Pope at the Tower of Babel. I really do hope to make a video and share these things with you because you know there's a spiritual underlying aspect to it. I mean, that's really what it reveals. And they are executing massive ritualistic things right now. They're conjuring this power. That's the only reason the Pope was even over in Iraq. Going back to the Tower of Babel, literally, it's insane. But the main reason, you guys, I wanted to do this video is the children. Once they're finished jacking everybody up that's old, you know, you notice how they're starting with the old people with the inoculations and work. They're coming for the children. They already are on top of it. Now it's getting to the point where they're wanting them all to go back to school, but they're not letting down with the vaccines. They're still continuing with all this stuff, even though they're opening things up and some states are letting the mask thing go away and all these things. It doesn't change the fact that this inoculation and this green pass system like what Israel's doing, which is just completely insane, but it's coming. It's a thing that is happening, and you can't deny it. The, the weapons that we use against this are not carnal. You, you must develop a personal relationship with your Savior, Jesus Christ. He's real. He's very close. He wants you to call on him so that he can come and reveal himself to you, but you have to sincerely and humbly want to know the truth and be prepared to accept it. It's that critical. But your children, you can do something about. Keep them close to you. Do not participate in the offerings of this world because it has gone completely off the rails in a wicked way. And it's obvious now. Biblical prophecy are playing out before your eyes. And there's going to come a time where God allows this wicked to do its work. But before that, he's waiting for you to call on him, be reborn in the spirit of the living God through Jesus Christ by belief on his blood. And if you don't turn to him, I just don't know what else to tell you. But this is what they're dishing up for your children now. There's never been anything like this virus in our lifetime. Often, it's hard to see the effects it's having on our children. Has this conversation taken place in your home? Mom, I'm scared about going back to school. I don't want to get sick, and I don't want to get you and Dad sick. Our scientists tell us there are three things we must do to stay safe. Wear masks, make sure we social distance, and wash our hands. 
and now your school with the help of Microsoft Corporation with the help of Microsoft Corporation has created another introducing daily pass your exclusive ticket for safely going back to school each week you can schedule your free on-campus COVID test the results are displayed in your daily pass and if you choose to take your test off campus you can post the results in your daily pass and the moment vaccinations are available, you'll simply be able to schedule yours through your daily pass. But the real magic is your daily health check. Just answer a few simple health questions every day, and like magic, your entrance ticket appears. Welcome back. Welcome to school. So, how did it go? Dad, I have to admit, I was scared at first, but then I felt so safe. It was so good to be back. Thanks for keeping me safe. I love you so much. Doesn't that just sound so happy and joyous? Share this with people, parents in particular. Letting them know that Jesus Christ is the only truth, the only life, the only way beyond this wickedness. This world's fading fast. Don't go down with it. God bless each and every one of you. Peace and grace to you. Many fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, 